So usually when it's like this, uh, you got probably more chances of tornado happening. As a matter of fact, uh, yesterday uh, there was uh, one tornado that touched down just north of uh, north of here. And uh, when you have these kind of formations, there's a high probability of a tornado warning that may or may not happen, but good possibility that it might touch down somewhere. There's also a possibility of a water spout because there's uh, intercoastal here. But uh, if it goes and touches on the land, well, then it turns into a tornado. Have I seen a tornado? Um, once. Uh, it was about, I would say, 500 yards from me. It was a small tornado, but it still made a bunch of damages. Uh, this was during a Hurricane Wilma. And it sounded like a train, honestly. It was like a, a fast running train. Like a, with a vacuum turned all the way high and rumbling train with a vacuum. Imagine a, a high pitched vacuum sound with a uh, train passing by really fast. It's kind of like that. It's really hard to explain unless you actually been through one. Uh, it's not pleasant. It's definitely not comfortable. Let's just put it that way. You see like in the distance when you see those sort of uh, formations, dark cloud formations and these uh, funnels. You see these funnels once in a while over here on that side. Um, that's that potential of circulation from what I understand or well, you got a good probability and a good chance of a uh, tornado uh, touching down let's hope he doesn't but look how dark the clouds have already become Like you see in the distance, you see like the funnels in the distance, you see those lines in the distance, like right there. That's the circulation, but that doesn't mean that it will happen. It just means that these types of circulations, when they occur, there's a high probability that you might have a tornado touchdown. And again, probability is just a probability but you never know and you definitely don't want to wait to find out listen to that wind look how it picks up right now listen listen the reason I'm doing this video is just because um, I just want to kind of give you a, my perspective on what it's like living in the tropics and you know here in Florida man we have the entire summer of thunders and thunderstorms and lightning um, you'll have a probably higher chance of uh, getting struck by lightning than you're gonna have uh, chances of a tornado to be honest with you if you're in the Midwest then yeah you will for sure have more chance of tornado but here the lightning strikes are just deadly and brutal Did I see something over here? Right there. See that right there, right above the sign. See that circulation? You see that circulation down there? That right there is where I'm looking at. See that circulation again? Right there. Right over here, right above. Right there. Let's keep looking. I see some more circulation on that side. Over here. We have to be uh, careful and watch out for the lightning. 
there's a pretty good chance we might see a lightning. Now they did issue a tornado warning for this area, so that's why I'm actually filming this. Yeah. What that basically means is that there's a good probability. When you have these types of uh, circulations on the clouds. Now the clouds have become super dark. And this is where you can expect a heavy downpour or rain. And uh, again, these tornadoes can appear out of nowhere at any time. Look at that intercoastal and just how fast the wind is picking up on that water. So any second now, expect to see a downpour with lightning and gust wind. Hopefully there's no tornado, but you never know. got a lot of formation on this side as well on the other side of the uh, intercoastal this area right here uh, got to keep an eye on a lot of circulations and when you see these kind of things with a low uh, low visibility, dark clouds circulating very close to the ground, like right over here you see that the one right there in the center you see that circulation right there I feel like uh, Bill Paxton may he rest in peace from the movie Twister, you know see that circulation right there too on the right side you know people who are watching this video I don't want you to think that I'm like oh hoping for a tornado God forbid I don't want to see a tornado dude nobody wants to see a tornado but there is a tornado warning in this area so that's why I'm filming this I wouldn't be filming this if there wasn't a warning because of the circulation that's happening around this area We got some circulation on this side over here as well, keeping an eye on it. All right, look at that formation. I just had somebody called me actually and asking about, you know, where the tornado hit yesterday. Uh, so it was north of here. Uh, it was a pretty, pretty bad tornado. Uh, it flipped a bunch of cars and, and, and trucks and damaged the, the roofs and ripped the roofs apart. Um, tornadoes are no joke, man. They're no joke. You gotta take it seriously. If I see a tornado, what I'm going to do? Well, <laughs> I'm going to go under the in a, in a garage 
uh, it's like a bunker underneath below sea level where it's safe you know and let's hope it doesn't happen okay and again I don't mean to repeat myself the reason I'm making this video it's not to uh, hope and wish for a tornado but just to uh, observe and see what happens because of uh, tornado warning that has been issued and tornado warning has been issued All right, so currently we've been cleared out for tornadoes, so, but that still doesn't mean that we're not going to get uh, hail and rain, uh, but the good news is at least for this area it has been cleared out uh, of any circulation, but there was a, as you saw earlier in this video, there was a possibility of that, but luckily it didn't happen, so... Uh, but you got to take it seriously. Even if it doesn't happen, you know, you never know, man. These these tornadoes can develop out of nowhere uh, so fast and quick, you know. So anyway, I hope you find this video interesting. Uh, it gives you some idea. Uh, you know, take the, these storm cells, take them seriously, guys. You know, people have died from lightning strikes, tornadoes, uh it has happened, man. You know, you got to respect the nature. You know what I mean? All right. Thank you for watching. Take care.